Sports News brought to you by Sport Pesa. All right, let's now get into sports news. The immediate former Harambe Stars coach, Jacob Ghost Mule, has cited that his departure as a head coach was due to personal reasons. While hosting a morning show on Radio Jumbo, Mule stated that he was having a difficult time and he believed that he could not carry out his coaching duties effectively. <laughs> Na fikiri tulipo kaa chini tukazungumza uh, bila wasiwasi wote uh, tukaelewana na shirikisho kwamba I think the best way ni mimi niwachie sasa mtu mwingine mm. aweze kuangazia kwa sababu ilikuwa na mipango yangu ya mali mali alafu pia Uganda mm. lakini nika, nikasema I might not be doing a good work for Kenya mm. kama naendelea kukaa pale na labda mimi mwenyewe niko na issues zangu personal mm. si itakuwa nikipatia na 100% kwa Rambi Stars mm. na tukaelewana na rais wa shirikisho ni kumwenda alikuwa na mkutano mzuri sana mm. na pia CEO wa shirikisho tukaongea mm. Kasema the best way I think coach uh, what do you think na kwambia the best way ni mimi kukaa kando mm. uh, nimeweka structures nimechagua wachezaji ambao ukiangalia average age ya number stars size ni 23.5 mm. na tunajua kwamba kundi letu ukiangalia mali ndio favorites mm. lakini hiyo imaanishi kwamba we cannot make it kwa sababu tuko na mechi na mali tarehe 5 tarehe 6 pale mm. kwa hivyo tumeweka mikakati eh, naweza nikasema nilikuwa nimeweka mikakati mizuri mm. shirikisho inajua nimefikia wapi eh ni nani labda nilikuwa na mipango na wao nikamwambia mali nilikuwa nime plan a b c d lakini mm -hmm. kwa sasa uh, for the betterment of the team mm -hmm. i think the best way ni mimi kungatuka mm -hmm. na kuachia baada ya kuja aweze kuchukua mikopo kwa hivyo it was a very mutual understanding oh, si hadi kuna mtu ni makubaliano mazuri ambayo tulikuwa nayo na ningependa mm -hmm. eh, hata kuchukua nafasi tena mm -hmm. uh, kwanza kushukuru shirikisho la kabumbu kunipatia hiyo nafasi mm -hmm. eh, kuweza kuhudumu kama mkufunzi wa timu ya Rambe Stars na mikakati ambao waliweka pale na sasa hivi nafikiri hata kocha ambaye atakuja hakuna wasiwasi. Well, the National Women's Volleyball Team Malkia Strikers confirmed their semi-final berth with a 3-0 win over Burundi in the ongoing Women's African Nations Championship in Kigali, Rwanda. Now, Gabon defeated Somaliland 3-2 in a Group D match played at the Nyayo National Stadium. Somaliland skipper Ahmed Said grabbed a brace in the 63rd and 67th minute with Gabon ensuring off the three points thanks to goals from Nzeng Jesse in the 10th minute, Musa Onenga and Ibrahim Ajabe in the 76th minute. To all people love me, I believe I can shine, I can raise the most. And three-time world champion Justin Gatlin arrived in the country ahead of the Kip Kano Classic slated for Saturday. The 39-year-old is planning to show more of his humanitarian side as he nears the sunset of his glittering career. Today we're going to talk, have a game plan going into next year, if there's going to be a next year. And, uh, but beyond that, it's going to be, you know, um, I want to show more of my humanitarian side. I want to be able to build, you know, a program that's going to be able to help athletes across the world in different sports. Um, I really believe that there's a there's a there's, there's a, a defect in sports around the world where a lot of athletes don't have the equipment or the means or the know-how or the coaching. You know what I mean? So to build a program that's going to help athletes um, from Dominican Republic, athletes be, become better baseball runners you know, baseball players, or having um, athletes here in Kenya become better sprinters or jumpers, you know, and believing in themselves. So building a program that can be worldwide. So that's what I want to work on. Mm -hmm. so, in, uh, so, so you want to sign off in style at your home soil, Oregon? 
we yeah. were with the third, fourth actually, fourth title, world title. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. So it, it depends. We'll see what happens. But as of right now, this is my last sport pesa.